What's going on people? This is just a chill stream, we're going to play scum for a bit. I have turned on the nudity sensor, as you can see. So, I'm going to create a new character because a lot has changed. A lot has changed. Uh, ooh, there's no points left for distribution now. Okay. Uh, they've not had any new characters apart from Danny Trejo. I'll just go with this guy, I guess. Tattoos. Available with support. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll go for them. Concealed mode is on. Penis size. Boom. Now. <laughs> you gotta think about the attributes and stuff, so I don't know. Just go 2.5. Two point four, whatever. Is that everything for this page? Yes. Right, got some of these to distribute. Um, I'll put up basic archery, basic running, basic endurance. Then we'll see what we've got left. Uh, Basic survival. We got basic engineering. What have we got left? Uh, I want to go medium engineering then. Medium survival. We got no left in intelligence, right? No. So dexterity. What have we got over here? Uh, hmm. Put some basic into driving. I don't really care because I ain't playing PvP. I'll give two flying shits about that. Um, hmm. Maybe just print and drive in there? I don't know. I don't know. Demolition, what does that cover? I'll put that back down there. So, concentration, I'm going to go advanced or medium on that, medium on that, okay. <clears throat> and then down here we've got archery, I'm going to go medium on that. Uh, rifles, medium. Alright, cool, looks good to me, name already taken, yes. By me, obviously. Go young any two. Take the space out. All right, there we go. My alias is Super Steam User. What? Whatever. My crime's arson. Can't you edit any of this stuff? No? Can't edit your height. Wait a minute. I'm sure you can edit your body and stuff like that. Wait, 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 wait. What's going on here? I guess because you can put weight on and stuff in game, you just start like this maybe. Floors are smoking. <laughs> Vaping now. Alright, uh, okay, wherever, let's get on with it. Should be full screen when it comes on. Go nuclear. Nuclear? Nuclear. Nuclear. It's nuclear. Some people say nuclear, and there's always a debate which one it actually is, but it is nuclear. Here's where it takes ages to load. This has been an update. Every time after an update, it hangs on this screen for ages. It's probably world generation, isn't it?
See what I mean? Takes forever. Don't think I put it on SSD either, so that's probably part of the issue. But it's like, I mean, it was 67 gig just for update, so it's a big game. God, it's smashing shit out of me, uh, SSD. What usually happens here is, to be honest, after an update, this screen usually crashes. Then I gotta restart the game and it loads straight up, then it's, it's pretty annoying. I'm thinking of getting a bigger SSD. Thinking of getting a 3 terabyte. Crucial P3, 3 terabyte. Like £240 or something though. Not cheap. And of course, it's slower than my Samsung one. Not by a lot, but it's slower. It's like 5,600 megabytes a second or something. And the Samsung one's 7,000. There we go, we're loading in, finally. And it's still loading in. Okay, uh, 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 oh. I can't remember how to open parachute or do anything or... Is that something I do myself or is it just going to let me do it? I mean, I'm in handcuffs. How do I, uh... <laughs> yeah, navigate. Yeah, that's easier said than done. I'm in handcuffs. Change pause. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. okay. And F to open parachute. Better do it now, because we don't want the rough landing. That would be a horrible start. No, not a tree. No. Fine, whatever. Right, okay, we are in. Now, if I can remember controls, that would be nice. Okay, I've got that set to my mouse. Secure communication with human asset established. Greetings, human All asset. Right. Search Welcome for rocks. To Island tutorial protocol Let's pick them provided up. by the Tech One Corporation. My designation is Dual Energetic Entity Neural Appliance Ordina. I am an artificial intelligence created by the Tech One Corporation. Yeah, I know you are. Overseeing the scum show protocols, including the preparation of human right, assets. Alright, first thing I'm gonna do, if you crafting to activate the tutorial, stone. Please do so oh, you could actually interface. go straight for an axe head. Secure channel closed. A minute. Oh, I'm gonna need a knife either way, though. I'll make a stone knife. We have a stone knife. Okay, can't fit it in my inventory, so it's gonna have to go in my hand. What's that? Start a bank card. Nice. That's new. Right. Uh, right. We need to find more stone. Okay, we have another stone. And we're going to create a small stone axe head. Let's see what she wants while we're at it. Uh, yeah, trap. Secure communication with human asset established. Welcome to the basic survival so of Stone axe heads tutorial. on the floor there. In this tutorial, we will Where establish the basic my skills you will stone need to survive. Knife. It dropped on the to floor. Start, please collect two solid masses of minerals or mineraloid matter, also known as. Uh, she wants me to do this for tutorial. Uh, search ground, find two stones. Okay, I just have to remember where that is. Nothing found. Good work, human asset. You can utilize gathered materials to craft a tool. Should have to activated proceed, that first, Shana, because now she wants me to craft interface. a stone knife Welcome again. Welcome to your personal user <laughs> interface. This interface is provided to each human asset by the Tech One Corporation. On the left side of your interface, you can see the resources required to build your desired item. Below it, you can see the items that you currently possess Don't and the Shut items up, in your vicinity. Good work. That stone knife is 87% adequate. 
Be careful though. Crafting an item does not automatically place it in Put down nearby bush, find work. long wooden stick. Did you know that 52% of human assets forget their crafted tools in the field? This is why we have decided to add this part of the tutorial for new human assets. You might as use your new knife to craft yourself a weapon. On Skull Island there are many dangers mm, and there is not a long wooden to stick. Yourself. To begin, cut down a bush. It's on the small ones. Uh, okay. Cut another... Mm, not that bush. I don't want to search, I want to cut. Olives? Okay. See, she's... Mm, she's getting me to do this, but... I don't want to do that, hang on. What I'm going to actually do is... Uh, I need to make a little backpack. Okay, improve career, improvised career backpack. Got the crafting requirements. Free cloth, rope, stone knife, saw. What we do is, uh, you can have tree bark rope as well. So it's five small wooden sticks. And we've got a few here. Uh, we've got two. Damn it. Uh, Mm. See, the problem is, you, at the moment, can't carry anything. That's the problem. It's only got his frigging pockets. Pockets on his pants and his shirt and stuff. Get a small, uh, long wooden stick from this. No. Okay, this is becoming a problem. Uh, bigger bush. Scroll wheel up and down. Change your run speed. I might have to make another uh, small uh, axe head because I might not find the damn thing back there. Right, we have a long wooden stick. At an adequate level. Craft an to improvised craft a wooden spear. The same steps you use to craft a stone knife. Yeah, yeah. Improvised wooden spear. Think I can put that on my back. I think. Congratulations, human asset. You have completed the basic survival simple so, crafting tool. There's my spear. Your stick it up there on my admirable. back. If you want to resume your training, please activate the next tutorial. Uh, yeah, Secure I'll do that. Request. Why not? Can you get the steam thing out of the way, please? Secure communication with human asset established. Welcome to the basic survival bag crafting tutorial. Cutting the shirt in the rags. On the island, you will need to carry numerous assets with you to survive. Ah, she's going to get us to make a bag, so that's cool. Learn how to expand your inventory space with a useful human utility. A bag. <clears throat> <clears throat> so they've changed tutorial, they didn't make you used to make a bag. Right, done. Cut pants into rags. Uh, no, I'm going to cut the box of briefs into rags. Actually, no, cancel, 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 cancel. Because it's going to want me to do the pants in it. Yeah, yeah. Should find some pants before long, though. No big deal. Cut into rags. I'm feeling slightly chilly. What do you expect? Rags I've got no frigging pants on. They can be utilized for Put two rags into rag stripes. Strips. I believe the term strips. Is bleeding. In this tutorial, we will focus on the crafting aspect of rags. To proceed, please cut two of your newly acquired rags into rag strips. There we go, that will be that. Good work. Rag strips have the Craft same improvised role. as rags. With your new rag strips, you are now eligible to craft an improvised rope through your crafting interface. Improvised rope. Do so now. It's 
We're gonna be on the floor because obviously I can't carry anything just yet. But Good work. Cool. You have now met all requirements. Craft improvised courier improvised cat backpack. Courier backpack. And do there so we go. Now. Let's do that. Come on. Come on. There we go. Now we just double. No, we don't double click it. We put it there. Run around and pretend you're a mule. Nice. It is still an early access. If you want to resume your training, please activate the next tutorial. So we'll take the stone knife. Take the rag strips. Oh, take a stick. Do they not? They don't stack, do they? No. Right, let's get the next tutorial going then. Place shelter, blueprint. Yeah. Secure communication with human asset established. Welcome to the basic So what I'm actually going to do tutorial. is go try and now find that thing again. Yourself with the crafting interface of items and tools. We will begin the blueprint training protocol. Here somewhere, won't it? Bigger human asset generated assets require blueprints due to lack of human memory capacity. Yeah, see this is problem. It's not going to be easy to find them things again. A quick and easy interface to guide you through the process. As that to begin said. The tutorial, please open your crafting interface. Uh, shut up a minute, woman. Nah, just have to make another one. It's easy enough for it down here. Nah, I'll make another one. Screw it. Uh, place shelter, right? So I don't want to do that yet. You can wait a minute. Want to get an axe? No frigging rocks, come on. Right, there's two rocks. Uh, I can't carry the other one. I don't know why I picked up the short stick, to be honest. Right, crafting. Ah, uh, shut up. Just like before. Small Go stone axe head. You find the blueprint section. Here you can find all the blueprints you are eligible to craft. Hopefully that'll fit there. Now. We will focus on building a shelter. Yes. Please pick a and shelter I don't need from your store. interface and place it where you most see fit. Shut up, woman. Shut up, woman. I am looking for a long stick. We have a long stick. I'll stick that on my back. And we need another improvised rope. Which is gonna take. Yeah, rag strips. Right, yep. Okay, I remember. So I'm gonna move my bank card over. Uh, I'm gonna take my socks apart. How many rag strips does it take? Can't remember. Five. Ooh, that might be a bit of a struggle. There were more rags over there, though, weren't there? Friggin Left them over there, now I don't know where they are. Yeah, only got two here. And the dot stack. But a courier backpack is better than friggin' nothing. Right, where was I? Somewhere over here, right? This is the thing, because it all looks the same. You don't know where you are. And finding stuff again is a bit of a nightmare. How are you doing, Daz? Where the hell did I cut them pants up? Ah, uh, can't see him anywhere. I'll just do what we're gonna do. Cut my shirt up. 
Tells me I am not bad. Tired, as usual, but, you know. Got everything done that I needed to do, so that's a bonus. Right, we're going to cut that into a rug. Then we're going to keep the last one, because that'll make a bandage. All right. We have the rag strips. Now I'm going to keep build the rag. All right, crafting. Improvised rope. Craft. Bada bing, bada boom. See, there's a tutorial now that tells you how to make an improvised backpack, which is damn cool because before it, it uh, didn't tell you how to do that. Uh, but I'm just doing my own thing a minute here. So, stone axe, craft. Probably going to drop it on the floor because I don't have space for it. Yep, dropped it on the floor. Um, can I? Yes, I can put it on my back. There we go. We've got space for it. Right, rag strips I don't need right this second, so I'm just going to dump them on the ground. Put that up there. I've got my knife. Cool. Right. Now I can do what this woman's badgering on about. I've got my spear. I've got my axe. She wants me to place a sheltered blueprint. Okay, where is it? They, they still need to add a search function here because there's too much shit and you just can't see where the shelter blueprint is. Oh, wait, it's building. It's in its own category now. Nice. Shelter, 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 shelter. Yeah, still not easy to find. <laughs> still not easy to find. Can't remember what I'm looking for, to be honest. Shelter. I forgot what the image of it looks like. Ah, these are blue these are some of the blueprints. Barbecue? No. Uh, where the hell is the shelter? Yeah, I know you're a bit chilly, you're in your box of shorts, that's why. Where is the shelter? I'm sure it used to be in here. Have they moved it? My god, I can't find the damn thing. Aha! Start to build my base on no one survived single place morning before going to madness. Nice. A lot of work in single player, isn't it? It is a lot of work. Let's see where we are. Uh, ooh, yeah. I forgot how huge this map was right down there. Nice and easy. Ah, not far from there. Okay, there's some cool stuff around here. Not a million mile away from a trader. Okay. Wait, play shelter blueprint. Uh, I just did that, woman. I just did that. What more do you want from me? Do you want me to place two? Just because you're awkward. No, I think maybe I have to uh, do what I'm doing with it first. I don't know how to remove it, though. Uh, ah, there we go. Right, what does it require? Eight long sticks, five short sticks, some more improvised rope and a log. Okay, choppy choppy. Choppy choppy. What's wrong with my arms right now? Uh, 
Oh, I've got pain in my hands from chopping. <laughs> okay. Feeling cold. All right. Yeah. Fair enough. Whatever. Hang on. Let me have a look at this journal. Cause place shelter br blueprint. Cut a nearby bush. Fill shelter. All right. She wants me to cut a bush. Oh. Loads of work. Decided to do storm walls too. Some more work than wood, I think. Oof, yep. A lot of work. Right, so I need... How do I rotate this? Ah, uh, it's another game where I can't remember how to frigging rotate stuff. Ah, uh, took it on my back. I would like to put it in my bag, but you know. I'm all turned around now, I can't even find the friggin' tree and bush I cut down, there we go. Pain in my hands is gone now. It was just because I was chopping. Yeah, it's a bit of a pain doing this at first, because... It's that initial grind, you know what I mean? That initial grind of having nothing and having to do everything slowly. Come on, where are they? If I could remember how to rotate stuff, put the fecking thing in my backpack. I, don't know. I cannot remember. Are we near any towns at all? Not really. There's one right end there, but eh. Dropped him frigging parachute in the middle of nowhere. Parachuted in in the middle of nowhere. Finally fell asleep at 3am then I were up at 9. Yeah, it was about the same time for me as well. About 3 o'clock. Then I woke up about 7 again. Irritating. Right, let's try and remember where we are. Okay, straight across. Oh my god, come on. <laughs> come on, game. Once I've got this tutorial over with though, it's done. Don't mess about with it anymore. Alright, that's the sticks in. Well, the small ones. The big ones now. If I can find them. Okay, one. I think you can make a, a bundle of them, actually. See, what I should have done was cut, took a small stick, or a long stick, over there and cut it in the small stick, so that would have friggin' helped, on it? But yeah. That would have helped. Uh, i tell you what I can do, though. Let's put my axe in there. Let's get rid of that. Let's take a log in my hands. A small log. Now, I'm not 100% sure this may only craft into firewood, but we'll see. Yeah, it's just firewood. Yeah. Pretty much just firewood. Damn it. Alright, let's start getting long wooden sticks in then. 
You don't even have to do this part tutorial. I'm just doing it to get a bit of money. Shut that woman up. I'm probably never going to use this. I'm just going to take over a building, most likely, and make that home. Right, the long stick's done. Kind of looks that way, doesn't it? Yes. So what I'll do is I will cut a closer bush. Let's hope to get some long sticks. It's a pretty big bush, so... Okay, yeah, long wooden stick. And uh, near that tree. And I've still got lost. There we go. So you get given uh, better clothes to start than no one survived. Yep, you do. You get your prison outfit. So the story of this game is you're a death row prisoner. And you get dropped on an island to survive with a load of zombies. But yeah, I've already cut up my... Uh, what do you call it? My shirt and my pants. And I've also, if you look, I've also got the nudity sensor on, because you know, Twitch. I think, yeah, he's got some good toes. Not keen on one on his forehead, but you know. <laughs> the rest of them are nice. Right, how many more long sticks did we need? Two, I think, maybe. I got one. No, yeah, I did get two from that. Ah, I know what I can do. Do this? Am I an idiot? There's an old little, uh, little old trick. Drag the damn thing with you. Oh, oh, they fixed it. You scumbags, literally they fixed it. You can't drag stuff with you anymore. Wait a minute, I'm sure you can. I'm pretty sure you can, maybe I'm just doing it wrong. Sure you can. Nope, I fixed it. Ah, damn it. Oh well. No more cheating and dragging stuff around with you in inventory. Ah well. Right, then I need more improvised rope. Uh, it can make that out of... Wait, that only comes out of rag strips. Wait, tree bark rope. Five small wooden sticks. Alright, have I still got my knife? Yes. Oh. Ah, come on. There's only three there. Still only three there. But if I cut down this other bush, there should be enough to do it. Ah, oh, come on. What do we got? Three, five, yeah, there's plenty. Right. Tree bark rope. Craft that shiz. Tell you what, my right arm's aching today. Probably from all mouse usage. <laughs> uh, can I hold that in there? Yes. It's only got ten, so I'm going to need a couple of them. Uh, right. Cutting the small sticks. Let's 
10 durability on the tree bark roper. And cutting the small sticks. Really, I wanted to be using a knife for this. I'm gonna wreck my axe, but never mind. It's fine. Mm, tree bark rope. See, usually, I don't even do this tutorial, but I'm just getting familiar with it again. I just usually uh, run off on doing my own thing and find a friggin' uh, find a house to take over. Average Ford Disliker, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Why do you dislike Fords? <laughs> how are you doing? I mean, I'm not a Ford fanboy, but eh. Used to work for him. <laughs> oh, yeah, I couldn't understand it then. I've heard it's not a great place to work. Alright, we have three tree bark rope. I'll let us go finish this thing off. If we can. Let's see. Uh, it's obviously going to take a log as well, isn't it? Not a small log, though. No. There we go. Tree back rope in. And there is a log. Right here. Got the sack because I got injured on the job. Wow. So you got injured and they sacked you for it. That's, yeah, that's not good at all. And I think the tutorial's broken. Yeah. That's probably why I don't usually do it. Right, yeah, tutorial missions. GTFO, get out of here, I don't care. Uh, what can we do with shower? Examine or destroy? Uh, I mean, there ain't much point destroying it, is there? I might as well just leave it there. Somewhere to lay down if I come back here. Boss ordered a rubbish engine. I was inspecting it up close while it was running and it exploded. Wow. That's a lawsuit right there. You should have sued him. I would have done. <laughs> uh, there's an airdrop coming in over that way. Which side of Ireland are we at though? We're facing water, water's on us left, so yeah, water's down here. So if we go up that way, in theory, nearly death at 21, wow. Yeah, I'd sue them, honestly. I'd sue the shit out of them. That was a proper uh, work-related injury there. Get a lot of money for that. Look at map. Yeah, we're heading general right direction. I hope it's not one of them where you need lock picks though. Everything's locked. That would be a massive claim. Yep, it would. You'd be looking in at multiple thousands. Boss went on the run because he. Tag it is wrong age group. Not sure what you mean. You mean he was a bit of a, a bit of a sex offender? Is that what you mean? <laughs> Sounds that way. Oh, yeah. Sounds like a complete asshole. I'm 37 chat. Oh my god. Yeah. Definitely uh, paedophile activity going on there. Definitely. That's pretty disgusting.
thing is, though, I mean, if, you, if you've if you got proof of it, which you do because you're injured, you sue the company. Forget the boss. You sue the company. I'm feeling pain. Why am I feeling pain? What is wrong with me? Stomach's growling with hunger, right? And I've got a hand abrasion from all shit I've been doing. But whatever, it's, it's a C1, it's no big deal, it's healing. Alright, I won't sprint then. Because I know that's going to make me more hungry. I hope when I get there, this friggin' airdrop in one of them big containers. You can't get in without lockpicks. I am heading that way anyway, though, because I want to get to Little Village, so there is that. Planning to go for a Vauxhall dealership soon. What you mean? As a job, yeah? I hear they're not much better, though. <laughs> I know the cars are shit. I had a couple of Vauxhalls. Proper problem cars. Should be strung up by his nuts, you got that right, Daz. Should be castrated. Dirty prick. Depends on car and age of the car. Oh, they're bad morning for us. <laughs> True. I don't think it does depend on age of the car, the, to, Daz, to be honest, because I had a 15 insignia. It was a shit box, it had problems all the time. And then as a courtesy car, I got a brand new 2021 Astra. And that were also a shit box. That had problems, I had to send it back. <laughs> and then everybody I know who's had Vauxhalls have just been like, yeah, problem every day, problem all the time, blah, 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 blah. Oh, yeah, you mean new ones, yeah. Uh, recently, I got my MOC, MOT certificate, so I'm set at the moment. Oh, so you can do MOTs? Cool. That's a decent job. Everybody needs an MOT. It's not something that's ever going to die. It's a pretty good job, is that? Brother had a Carlton for a few years. He loved it. Ah, see, that's before there were... Uh, <coughs> before they were made by you know made up of all different parts from different companies wasn't it just one company making them 50 quid a pop and you have to take nothing off yep if you go to one at garages I once went to all you have to do is uh, stab underneath that car with a screwdriver and that's MOT done <laughs> dodgy pricks they were went through three or four Novas what, what brand of car were Nova's now? I can't remember. Uh, Vauxhall you Nova, wasn't son that? of yeah. a bitch. Thank you for the follow as well, Average Ford Disliker. Much appreciated. Welcome to the team. It is one of them, isn't it? Yep, it is. Gonna need lockpicks for everything. Yep, everything's locked. I ain't got no lockpicks, so I ain't getting in there. Little boy racer hot hatch. <laughs> really want a Suzuki Jimny. <laughs> Do it, yeah. They're bulletproof cars, apparently, them, though. Somebody I know had one for about 20 years. Had it for a very long time. See, I've, I've had Volkswagens, Vauxhalls, um, Hyundais. And they've all just crapped out on me. So I went back to Mercedes because I've had like two of them now and they've not given me many problems. Cheap on road tax as well. Jimneys are cheap on road tax. Ah, yeah, a lot of them are petrol, aren't they? I know you, you know a good getting a Range Rover out these days because it's like £700 a year road tax. <laughs> Ridiculous. I pay 240 for mine. Madness. Only car I ever owned and drove twice is a Mark II Fiesta. Nice. So you have actually drove before then, Daz. No, you don't have a licence, but... 
Well, I suppose. Like me, I suppose. It's like, is, when I went for my lessons, he's like, oh, you've drove before, are not you? I'm like, uh, I'm saying nothing. <laughs> I'm saying nothing. <laughs> no license. I have a license to kill. <laughs> Plead the fifth, yep. Yeah. Exactly. I just put it down to my driving simulators. <laughs> just said, yeah, I play a lot of American Truck Simulator and uh, stuff like that. He's like, oh, all right, yeah. <laughs> Did help me with my bus license, though, playing like Bus Simulator and OMSI and shit like that. Supposed to take like a few attempts to reverse park a bus, but I did it first time. Nailed it. Didn't even need to do it again. 100%ed it. Alright, I need to find some food. So I'm hoping at this little fishing town there's going to be some food. Because, uh, yeah. Pretty bad right now. Might have to just eat some olives for now or something. Yep. Yeah. The, well, I know they're raw. They're olives. How can they not be raw? Gonna have to eat a few for now. That's, that's all I can do. Just keep me going a little bit. Let's have a look at my metabolism. So, they're in my stomach. But they're going to take time to get from intestine to colon and shit like that. So, they're still feeding me. Uh, hello, I didn't know you were streaming. It didn't notify me. Yeah, yeah. No, it never does notify its pain at ass. How are you doing anyway, killer? Uh, doing my lessons in an Ibiza for the moment. Oh, nice. They're not bad cars. Uh, my ex was trying to teach me to drive in a Nissan Amera. <laughs> Can't remember what I learned to drive in. It was a little, uh, well, not learn to drive, I say, because I already knew how to drive, but take my lessons. It was a little, um, little Citroen, I think. Shitty car. Normally notifies me, but oh well, I'm here and I'm good. Yeah, see that's the thing, Twitch is, Twitch is always hit and miss with notifications for me. It's like half the time when people are streaming, it's like I've just gone on Twitch by chance and seen them streaming, it doesn't notify me, it's a pain in the ass. Uh, Clutch is very spongy. Mm. Is there something wrong with it? Because... I've not really heard anyone complain about that with our, with a beefers, to be honest. Maybe it's uh, maybe it's a bit faulty. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. Didn't notify me when I got a sub a couple of days ago when I was streaming. Ah, that's the worst. That's like whoever subbed will be like, oh, the guy didn't even give a shit. You know what I mean? But it's like, yeah, not my fault. <laughs> I didn't get no notification. This is a huge map. I forgot how big this map was. And running around. And the best thing to do. I mean, the olives are still feeding me, so... They should kick in soon. It says my stomach's empty, but... Clearly it's not. I only noticed because they had the icon next to their name after a little while. Yeah. It's the problem, innit? I, I hate Twitch's notifications. Does my head in. So have any of you guys played this game then? I know Daz not What about you, Killer? And uh, Ford? I'll just call you Ford. It's easier. <laughs> oh, you have played Scum. Nice. What do you think? Tavig oh, right, yeah, you're saying yeah to, yeah, the other thing. Tabby gonna murder me, no, not played it. <laughs> Why is Tabby gonna murder you? What have you done? <laughs> Just saw a bloke on Facebook absolutely fuming with his roommate. 
Asked him to swap his oil. He drained his transmission fluid and overfilled his oil. Oh, shit. <laughs> wow. Rookie mistake. Uh, I've added a new sound alert. I've named it Tabby. It's a jump scare. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, wow. You shouldn't have said that. She might be watching. <laughs> She's been about a couple of days. Uh, that's going to that's gonna scare shit out of her, though. I was on about making her a mod the other day. She goes, I shouldn't have that kind of power. Because uh, killer, ki killer keeps scaring shit out of me, so... Uh, I should not have that kind of power. <laughs> I should not have checked viewer list. Alright. <laughs> See you for Super easy jump scare. <laughs> I noticed that when I was watching your stream before. And she's like, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> These olives are not doing me very good either. Hundred and ten calories. And they give me a bit of water as well. But yeah. I'm empty on everything. Need to find some proper dumb food. Problem is a time it just right. Time it just right normally when she's eating or drinking, she ends up wearing it. <laughs> yeah. Them are the best jump scares. Pretty thirsty as well, actually. It's all this frigging jogging. But I need to get to a town. I dropped in in a shit area, to be honest. Dropped in in a really shit area. Bit hard to navigate when you got your hands handcuffed behind your back, though, or zip tied or whatever. Uh, also, remember she was reading one day and I jump scared her and she launched a book. <laughs> seen people like that on YouTube that are proper easy to scare. You just do just do a quiet noise like boo like that and they just jump out the skin. <laughs> uh but I'm working for the range at the moment. I had to chuck some bloke out because he was pissing he was pissing on toaster displays. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Where do you live? <laughs> You live in Bizarro land or something. <laughs> you don't live in Bradford, do you? <laughs> that is Bizarro. Oh, Doncaster. <laughs> yeah, understood. <laughs> understood. I were in Doncaster the other day. It's, uh, yeah. It's, um, different, to say the least. <laughs> uh, ruined one of her tops before from a jump scare. She was eating spag all the time. I th I think that was the one when I were in. I think that was the one. Oh god. Yeah, that was funny. Yeah, I went to uh, Yorkshire Wildlife Park like last week or something. Well, I've been at Doncaster a few times though, it's yeah, it's very different. Hey up duck! <laughs> I'm dying. Oh, you've been through Doncaster a couple of times, does? No way, Duck's Barnsley, innit? Hey, up, Duck, that's Barnsley. Yeah. It's crap, but it's home. Yeah. Uh, I can't say no, I'm from Bradford originally, so there you go. <laughs> say no more. Say no more. Right, we're coming up on some buildings now. We are coming up on some buildings. All right, my ducks Nottingham. Really? I've never, never heard him say that in Nottingham. They do in Barnsley. They sell it a lot. Just outside of Newcastle, yeah. That's the one where it's way, eh, man? <laughs> Rather live here than Barnsley. Yeah, Barnsley's. Uh, yeah, 
Perhaps there's a shithole as well. <laughs> to be honest, Doncaster's ra better than Bradford. I can easily tell you that one. Uh, oh, well, all we're going to find in here is pointless searching these, and we're just going to find like scrap metal and shit. Now they say it a lot in Nottingham. Huh. You learn something new every day. I didn't, I didn't know they said that at all in Nottingham. It's traditionally like a Barnsley thing. Actually, a Geordie, though. I wasn't born in Newcastle. Yeah, can kind of tell that with your accent, because you, you haven't got the full thing going on. Oh, crap. Oh, my God, I can't remember how to get into... No, no, I'm going to die. I can't remember how to get into combat mode. Wait, do you have to anymore? I don't think you do, do you? I don't think you have to get into combat mode anymore. Huh. Pokey pokey. Pokey pokey. I'll read your comments in a minute, guys. It's just... This game's ruthless with the zombies and shit. I'll be real careful. I'm running out of stamina quick. Oh my god, just die of the med. These guys harder or some shit. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm dead. I'm gonna be dead. I'm going to be dead. This is bullshit. Get down, you fat prick. Jesus Christ. It's a good job I kept that frigging thing, innit? Uh, they're only C ones. Yeah, there's no point treating them. They're only C ones. All right, let's have a look. Uh, the last I'm seeing says it a lot to me, so I say quack. <laughs> yeah. All my family are Mackhams. What's Mackhams? <laughs> I don't know what that is. True George is born within a mile of River Tyne in either Newcastle or Gate said I was born in South Shields. Alright, cool. From Sunderland. Huh. Right, even though they are crap. Probably, yeah, 5%. I will... No, will I take them? No, my shoes are better. I'll take the pants, though, even though they're crap. They're wrecked, but I will take them. A Macken is someone born in Sunderland. Ah, okay. Right, yeah, I get you. How come I changed shoulders? Oh, it is V again at combat. Stance. How come I change? Ah, there we go. Q and E to change your frigging shoulders side and lean. Right. I'm going to shut all these doors because that was not nice. Let's hope to find some food and drink. Nothing. God damn game, come on, give me something. I mean, soy sauce, really? <laughs> Ooh, a pirate hat. Eh, why not? <laughs> why the hell not? Yeah, we'll have a beanie. <laughs> we don't want a pirate hat. Although it would suit me, but, you know. Yarr. Uh, let's check this orange. Ooh, it's slightly off. I, I don't really want to risk eating that. I ain't got no gastric medicine or all. Is that the same one? Yeah. Apparently, Mackums and Geordies uh, don't like each other at all. Uh, no idea. You have to ask Daz about that one. <laughs> I have no idea. Alright, what's in the vicinity? Nothing. Wow. This place with a bit of a bust, on it? Whoa, I am now invisible. No, now I'm not. 
This is true, but it's more of a football thing. Ah, right. Yeah. Don't do football. Should I take a dump while I'm here? I don't need to. Like us, we're Rotherham. You're talking a foreign language to me now, guys. I don't do football. Can't stand it. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll take that. Alright, what will I get if I drink this soy sauce? Energy, proteins, no fat, but some water. Uh, check it. It's not going to be off, is it? Soy sauce. No, screw it. Let me drink it all. Screw it. Them olives are still getting into my system as well. Prefer the more civilised rugby. Uh, I used to like rugby, but I'm not keen on that either, to be honest. I like my American sports, NBA, NFL, UFC, kind of things. Oh, what's wrong with my head? Hunger and thirst. So I've got a headache because I'm hungry and thirsty. My left arm's hurting because I'm hungry and thirsty. What? Oh no, it's bleeding injury. Right, okay, and I've got a bleeding injury on my head. But they're stabilised, so I don't have to worry about them. Uh, Doncaster and Rotherham fans absolutely despise each other during matches, fights all the time. Yeah. See, that that's the aspect of football I don't like. It's just a bunch of idiots, to be honest. Our team lost. Let's fight. Our team won. Let's fight. <laughs> Makes zero sense to me. Bunch of drips. Uh, well, they want all amazing here, well, let's hope to find something good in houses. Yeah, that stamina fucked me up big time. That was a problem. Stop going, because me and my mate got jumped outside train station. Yeah, I'm not surprised, it's just, it's, it's stupid, eh? It's just stupid, eh? Like, you can't just go enjoy the game, you know what I mean? And there's always got to be some shit. And it's like, what, what do you get so arsy over? It's a game. Calm yourself down. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's a fucking game. I don't get killed on scum and go outside and smash somebody's head in, do I? You know what I mean? It's <laughs> just dumb. I thought that <laughs> I thought that were a window and somebody outside it. Then I shit myself. <laughs> Oh my god. This game's got to me. Reindeer ears. No thanks. See, this is just single player, so I ain't really... I haven't been able to set up server settings at all, so... I think everything's just pretty scarce and shit at the moment. But I kind of like it that way. Shit when you get too much loot. Used to work at St. James Park and at Stadium of Light. And no idea where they are, does. <laughs> Again. It's about football, so you're talking a foreign language to me. Spinach seeds. Well, they're not going to do me much good, are they? Nails, wire... Uh, waiting for the ambulance and someone from the pub across the road fetched us a pint each. <laughs> nice! <laughs> At least on a bright side. Newcastle and Sunderland grounds. Car jack? I don't know what I'm going to need that for. Free Stella can't complain. Yep. You definitely can't complain at Free Stella. If it were Carlin, eh, yeah, you probably could complain. <laughs> well, 
not finding much in here. Bit of a bust this place, gotta be honest. Right, we will take that though. Gonna make cutting trees and shit easier. I've done that. There's gonna be a zombie in one of these houses, isn't there? I can. can... Yup! Called it! Right. Carlin's unspeakable. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty bad. What are you doing, you dumbass? I'm going to open the gate for you. There you go, come on. Oh, you a fast one, eh? Yeah, undrinkable too. See, the fast ones are pretty easy to kill. They're fast, but they're easy to kill. Then the bigger guys are slower, but they're harder to kill. I mean, everything he's got on him is wrecked. Sigs. Yeah, I'll take them. I mean, the pants are wrecked anyway, so I might as well put the jeans on. They're a bit, bit tougher. Open finger gloves. No, there's some gloves in the house. I don't need to worry about them. Alright, uh, let's get out of... Uh, let's put my spear away. Don't think there should be another guy in here. Tried Madril recently. Oh, I've never heard of that. I've never heard of it. Yeah, there's some proper open finger gloves. What is it? Uh, is it a beer, Madri? A lager, bitter, is it spirit? Well, I've never heard of it. Beer. I prefer real ales. I prefer spirits. Used to be on hard stuff. Hence why my name's Young Henny. <laughs> Hennessy. Hennessy, Alize. Love that shit. Vodka were never a good idea for me though. <laughs> Used to get very nasty on vodka. Then again, who done, I guess. Not great, not great for the old mood, is it, vodka? Uh, I'm predicting no zombies in this one. You brewed vodka once it were lethal. <laughs> Sixty-seven percent, Jesus. I used to have um, a Hungarian friend, and his dad made some. I don't even know what it was called. He made some spirits once. Jesus Christ! I had a sip of it. One hundred and ten percent. Absolutely lethal. That's rotten. I ain't eating that. Run a card on it, <laughs> yeah. I need to be pulling stuff out of here, don't I? Cause... Wait, don't let you quickly pull stuff out of cupboards anymore. Oh, I guess I did. Yeah, I did. Oh, a police fishing hat. Or a JW cap, I don't know. I don't know, just keep the beanie on, I don't know. Ah, yeah, keep the beanie on. It's a blue friggin' fishing hat. Jameson's, yeah, Jameson's alright. It ain't bad. I never minded it.
mind uh, Captain Morgan either. Captain Morgans are alright. Depending which one. Some of them were a bit... Uh, some of the flavours were a bit nasty, but... Tell you what I can't stand, and everybody absolutely loves it these days. Gin. Gin is disgusting. It's like my mate, my mate once got it, and he's like, Oh, it's flavoured though, and I tried it, and I'm like... Pfft. Shove that shit straight up your ass, mate. I don't care if it's flavoured or not, it's disgusting. <sighs> yep, Captain Morgan's spiced rum. Ooh, we've got an advanced pick lock. A lock pick, if you like. Rope as well. Uh, I'm gonna get spoilt for choice here. Uh, I'm gonna put the SIGs down. I'm gonna drop the stone tool because I can just make one of them anytime. Wait, why won't that fit there? Uh, it's four squares game. Uh, too big to go in pocket, I guess. That can though. Wait, it's too big to go in pocket, but the wine will go in there. What? <laughs> okay. Gin's nasty, yep. Yeah. We are all in agreement with that one. It's terrible. Keep forgetting to drag the stuff out of loot containers. Hmm, not finding much around here. To be honest, it's a bit shit. Did we do that building? No. Well, we started building and done that. Still complaining that he's thirsty, you know. I mean, the soy sauce is still going into my system, but... Uh, drink a bit of wine. I don't want to get drunk, though. So we'll just drink a bit. We'll drink a little bit. It'll start kicking in. We'll probably start swaying around, but, you know. Better than dying of thirst. I think. <sighs> really. I mean, rags are always good to have. My cousin just did something bad. Hopefully nothing too bad. But an astron didn't even pop the bonnet. Ooh. That is, uh, yeah. It's just asking for trouble. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. We got a fat boy. I don't really want to deal with Mr. Fat Boy. So I am probably going to leave him where he is. I should have shut the door and locked him in. I should have shut the door and locked him in. Stomach's grumbling again. No zombies in here? No. Good. Right. Shut the damn door. Uncle just messaged me, gave a description of what the engine sounds like. <laughs> I can imagine. I mean, Astras are just bad cars anyway. Makes it worse at the Vauxhall. <laughs> Pack of shite, yeah. Oh, you beauty. Backpack. Ah, I mean, it's not very big, but eh, whatever. Better than crap I've got. Better than the crap I've got. Oh, mod caught you. <laughs> um, <yeah. laughs> that is a good description though. 
That is a damn good description. <laughs> Guess you allowed that one, Daz. Yeah, we're not bothered about wanking. That's not really offensive. Ooh. 93, 97. Ah, oh, killer did. <laughs> no worries. Hmm, do we go for the other gloves? Let's see what they look like. Eh, yeah, I mean, the same, but yeah. Didn't seem that bad. Yeah, the the auto thing just, it just catches stuff that I'm not even bothered about now and again, you know what I mean? Uh, he just sent me a photo of my cousin with his head in his hands. <laughs> oh my god. Picture tells a thousand words, doesn't it? Yo, Shine, how you doing? What's going on? See? Somebody just said wanking. Let's have a look at these. Now they're slippers. Uh, I do not want them. I'll keep them for Daz. <laughs> More frigging gloves in here than I know what to do. Will you give me some decent pants. Ah, there we go. Alright, take them crap off. They're all in them. No, they're in. Alright, so now I have pockets. Doing good. <laughs> I'm being flanking Mad Max today. Oh my god. 14 minutes till Q sim. <laughs> That's too much information, that shine. <laughs> TMI. Too much information. How are you doing after that stupid non going to YouTube game? Eh, alright. Managed to figure building out a little bit better last night, so it stopped driving me as mad. Uh, I'm going to take this crappy trucker jacket off now because. It's pointless, let's be honest. It's damaged and it's shit. Mad. Crazy. Mad. Crazy. Oh, there is. Ah, it's empty. Oh, damn it. Empty well. Went to the well one too many times. Just realised I'm probably going to be the one to fix that thing. <laughs> probably. Mad Henny like Mad Max. <laughs> yeah, maybe. What was his name? Rokotansky? Max Rokotansky. I think. Plenty of wine corks. Somebody's drunk all the good stuff before I got here. Oh, thank you too. No thanks. <laughs> I'll pass on that. <laughs> you keep your hands to yourself. What's that? Spices mix. Ah, oh, you can eat them. Yeah, definitely passed that test. <laughs> I like females. <laughs> I like females. Right, well, I checked everything here. I have a lot of crap left now. I hear a zombie. Uh, they call them puppets on here, don't they? But whatever. Zombies. I like big butts and I cannot lie. <laughs> Ooh, gasoline canister. It's got some in it as well. Wetness, 0%. Okay. Oh, 
What's wrong with this guy now? Ooh, some nine mils. Nice if I could find a nine mil gun. Dry fuel, yeah. You sent me a list of stuff that needs changes. Might as well get a new engine on a new car. That's yeah, that's usually the case with Vauxhalls, especially Astras. <laughs> Throw it away, start again. <laughs> right, well, this guy's complaining. He's got no drink in him. But we did drink some uh Oh, I've got a water deficiency, that's why. How do you cure this shit? Weakness and fatigue. Occurs when water level falls below zero. It's three stages. Symptoms of following weakness and fatigue while untreated. Gradually losing health. Drink water until you recover lost. Water supplies. 30% water is needed to fully heal. Ooh. Imagine I like females with a Samoja. <laughs> yeah. Traded it for a Suzuki Swift. Ooh. Bad decision. Water dropping out your mouth. Yeah, that's what happens. <laughs> Go get the Swift back. Good idea. See, this will give me 88.5 grams of water, so it's... But it's going to make me drunk. It's the only problem. I'm going to end up a frigging wino. <laughs> Don't be calling people stuff shine. They might not have the same uh, sense of humour as you. <laughs> I know you're not directly meaning it, but they don't know that. Alright, so the water deficiency is getting good. Does it look like I speak British when I use wanker? No, because you spell it wrong. <laughs> but if you spell it right, the uh, the auto mod will catch you anyway. <laughs> but you see, that, that word for us is a... Um, what do you call it? It's an insult. So yeah, you might want to not use it as much. <laughs> Vauxhalls are okay cars. It's the engines that are dog shite. Yeah. Yeah. I guess you're right. Stomach's growling. Yeah, because I'm freaking starving, that's why. That's bollocks. <laughs> yeah. Or oh, bollocks. <laughs> Bloody bollocks, mate. Yeah, it's actually bollocks, as in testicles, balls, you know. B-O-L-L-O-C-K. Bollock. Alright, I've got to get my tools, see if I can save it. Have a good one, you lot. Yeah. Uh, good luck with that. <laughs> good luck with that, Ford. <laughs> Thanks for dropping in. I'll see you soon. Hope you have a good day. I mean, by the sounds of it, you're not going to, but... <laughs> Hope you do. How are you doing, Jimmy? Good afternoon, sir. Uh, I don't want to wear a kilt. I'm not Scottish. Remember your big hammer. <laughs> yeah. You have to go play Q Sim. <laughs> Good luck with that as well, killer. You're also going to need it. <laughs> High heel sandals or motorcycle boots? Ooh. Motorcycle boots then. Why not? Thank you, killer. You have a good stream and enjoy your day as well. And thanks for dropping in. I'll see you soon. How are you doing, Jimmy? Is it afternoon there? Bollocks. <laughs> yeah, it is. 
And everyone in chat right now has a pair. <laughs> cool J, nice game, looks tough. Yeah, it's uh it can be. Like if you jump into it and you don't know what you're doing, then yeah, it's it can be a problem, but If you know what you're doing, it's not so bad. See that? I've put the, I've got a shirt, a leather jacket, and a raincoat on. It's bloody night there. No, uh, probably yeah. PVP? Nope. You should have known the answer to that question, Jimmy. No PVP, single player. Even when I do multiplayer, I, uh, I get my own server and. Uh, Outlaw PvP. Although I do normally make a private server anyway, so... This wanker never plays PvP. <laughs> no, I don't. We all hate PvP. Dang hackers. Did they, did they get you again, Jimmy? Socks. Knee high, friggin' tartan socks. Oh well. Might as well put them on. Not insulting, don't get mad. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know you just love saying it. 129 minutes of Q-Sim. Holy shit. Yeah. Now, now you're probably going to start to see why I refunded it. Thankfully, I was lucky. Yeah. Yep, you got very lucky there. Assholes, honestly. Right, hopefully, hopefully there's no zombie in here. Ooh, there's some cash though. I will take that. Short paddle. No. I don't intend to go on a boat any time right now. So we shall leave that. Diablo 4Q. Yep, how did you guess? <laughs> right, I'm going to take them military boots. Or construction boots or whatever. I'm going to leave motorcycle ones. And take the construction ones. Yeah, because I'm a wanker for using wanker a lot. It might sound bollocks to you, but I don't give a bloody fuck. You love the British accent and slang, don't you? Dropped out of 49 minutes. Ooh. You got lucky there. I still won't wait 49 minutes, to be fair. <laughs> I don't have the patience for that shit. It's like, what annoyed me about it were like, I don't even want to play multiplayer. Diablo, for me, has always been a single-player game, so why should I sit in a queue? To play a game in multiplayer that I don't want to play in multiplayer. It's just, no, it annoyed me. <laughs> Bro, turn me British. <laughs> Tempted not to. Yeah. So it's just, uh, it's a pain in the ass, honestly. It's, it's not good. Oh, I don't want to search for rocks. Oh, I'm sweating. Uh, I am going to... I'm going to take the motorcycle jacket off. Play Mad Max? Nah. Finished that game ages ago. Long, long time ago. Good game, though. Keep forgetting to drag the stuff out of the thing. Good classic single-player RPG game. It is. It is a damn good game. Underrated, if you ask me. Yep, I have played it. Toss up between God of War and all survived. <laughs> See, two very different games, so it's a hard choice to make. Played it too like seven years ago. Yeah, it will have been somewhat, somewhat like that. I played it on Xbox 360, I think. It feels good to play it again, yeah. 
I went back to it a couple of years ago on PC. It's a damn good game. A bamboo hat? No. Nope. Uh, right, we've got issues here. I need to find water. Like the hell with the wine, because it's going to get me drunk, but... I need to find water. Hungry as well. Getting 160 FPS feels powerful. <laughs> yeah, that'll happen from an old game. Drunkenness, you see, drunkenness is creeping in. can lead to puking and movement restrictions. Upon the maximum amount of alcohol the bloody can handle, death ensues. Treatment, stopping alcohol consumption. <laughs> oh shit, Sherlock. But we need water, that's the problem. I mean, that is... It's, it's drip-drabbing its way into the stomach, so... And, well, bladder, I guess. But, um, yeah... Good news, guys, we signed yesterday for the new place. Got keys and call ISP. We got satellite dish up. All of the privatised channels. And Monday we're getting one gig fibre in the house. Nice. So have you already actually moved in then fully? Or have you, you still got some stuff to move and stuff like that? Oh, shit. Yep, you can stay in there, mate. See you later. Yep, that is good news. One megabyte per second. <laughs> yeah. Uh is that another one in here? Slump painted, electrician, plumbing, all next week, then we start moving in. That's why you've been doing all them handyman games, isn't it? And getting practice. <laughs> there is a ball ache moving in, but once you're in and settled, it'll feel a lot better. There's going to be one upstairs, isn't there? That's what, is that what all this fuss and noise is? No. Where is that thing then? <laughs> you know me too well. <laughs> it's that little scrap. I need food, damn it. That might be scary. Yeah, the zombies are, uh, yeah, I can hear them. It's going to take a good month to settle in. Yeah. Takes me longer than that. <laughs> when I move, takes me about three months to settle in. Does my head in at first. Where is this Zombro then? Probably in here, right? No? Okay. We I don't know where he is then. It's probably that other one in that other building making a load of racket. No. Drop it? Oh, right. Right. Put it on the floor. Put it on the floor. You played Days Gone? No. Not yet. A good game though. Uh, we're going to be four peeps in the house. Oh, correct. <laughs> yeah. It's amazing. Yep. I've just not got round to buying it yet, or playing it even. It's having the time. So many games, you just don't get enough time to play them. Alright, what have we got in here? Hopefully some food. You know, I'm not even... I'm not going to bother dragging stuff out of inventories. I can't be bothered. I need to find food. I ain't got time for that. I'll do that later. Yo, Cryptic, how you doing? Bit early for you, Brad. <laughs> I 
I suppose it is four o'clock here. Day's gone, the one with the Harley and zombies. Yep, that's the one. On your break at work, damn. Already working, eh? <laughs> it's about an hour short of noon. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, there's another backpack here. Um, let me see the size of it. Is that bigger? Looks bigger, right? I mean, only slightly, but it does look bigger. Uh, could be the same. Uh, 6 p.m. in Greece, yep. These time, these time differences get very confusing. See you on that scum. Yeah, I've not played for a while. I'm uh, trying to explain to Daz how, how good of a game it is. You know? Yep, always single player. No shitty PvP. Always SP. But if... Uh, Daz does decide he likes this game. Then I would probably put up a server. Is that a spear or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> Maybe a bit of both. <laughs> Wait, I can't. Oh, right, I had a pirate eye patch on, didn't I? Really? Goggles? I'll stick with the eye patch. Uh, there are some decent PvE servers. Yeah, I know, but it's like... The thing is that most of them expect you to be on there all the time. That's what I found anyway. They expect you to be active all the time or they just end up kicking you out. And it's like, yeah, but I can't be active all the time, so... I can't be bothered with them kicking me out. <laughs> Tracksuit top. Uh, I'll probably take that instead of shirt, right? It's getting dark. I still haven't found no food or anything. Well, yeah, why not both? <laughs> Early stream today, then another at 8 pm. Yep, yeah, that's right, Jimmy. Well, this one was just more of a chill one. Didn't expect so many to pe many people to turn in, but I mean, it is scum. It is a mega popular game. I probably should have expected it, but yeah. Alright, I'll we'll put the darker jeans on. Friggin' skin tight anyway. Really a Halloween knife thing that looks like a knife going through your head. <laughs> Objective of this game, survive. <laughs> That's your objective. Yep, survive and thrive. That's the one. <laughs> Paul looks it's about 8 pm here. So you're in front. You're in front of me. Like four hours ahead. Jimmy's two hours ahead. Brad's, what, about three hours behind? Three, four hours behind? Three? Yeah, three hours, I think. Nope. There probably ain't going to be any food in there anyway. Uh, you played since they put the new nuclear power plant in before today. Nope, not yet. That's why I wanted to get on it as well. Uh, is there like a deadline ring of gas that closes in on you or something? Nope, nope, none of that. None of that, um... Battle Royal shit. None of that. I hear a zombie. That's not good. Well, not a zombie, a puppet. Yeah, I need food and drink. This is becoming a major problem. Open map. Yep. I don't even know where nuclear power plant is, to be honest. I am in a horrible, horrible place down here. It's not good at all. It's in D0. Uh, D0. Ah, so it's all the way up there. 
Uh, how long does this game go till you die or store it? It basically goes on for you forever. D-O-N-5 ish near the river. So like kind of here, maybe. Ah, C O. I hate how they do this. It should go A, B, C, D, E, and then letters across the bottom, but it doesn't do that. It's, uh, C O. Ah, it's probably this, right? Yeah. Pixels. <laughs> yeah, it's probably this. And it doesn't help that Twitch only allows a 1080p stream, does it? Uh, let's have a look. Yep, still, still empty. I need food. Uh, when you see the rest of the map outside the current, you'll see why they went bottom to top. What, the expanding map again? I hate that you can't zoom in as well. That doesn't matter. In. All islands are supposed to be done at some point. Ah, yeah. I uh, don't really like survivals with no story, no direction or conclusion. I like Sons of the Forest. Yeah, good game. Too short, though. But it is early access. But, I mean, you kind of do have a direction in this. It's just not a story direction. You build your base, make it bigger, get vehicles. That kind of thing. There's bunkers to raid. There's airdrops to hack, like... Hacking one loot. Uh, that's the thing. I don't like being told where to go and what to do either. Yeah, I mean, I don't mind either. I don't mind either, to be honest. I like a good story game and then I like survival games. <clears throat> I mean, we do have tutorials and stuff, like missions. But it crapped out on me, so I didn't bother doing it. It says place shelter blueprint. I put it down. It didn't acknowledge it. I tried it twice, but it didn't work. But there's going to be side missions and missions. There's traders to go to. Uh, you're a prisoner that's put on an island to fight against other prisoners for a television show. That's a backstory. That's your freedom. Yep. Kind of like that film, The Condemned. Ooh, a walnut. And I'll take a kitchen knife. Can I crack this walnut? Let me check it. Well, I know it's raw. It's a friggin' nut. Uh, it's not hot. Eat it. Whatever. Don't have to crack it, I guess. What's that? Hazel. Can I eat Hazel? Everspace 2 full release coming out April 6, 2023. Is that that space survival game? Or is that other, is it that other one where they're wanting you to pay a friggin' paid subscription? Which one is that? I don't need them socks. Or is it Evo Space? There's Everspace and Evo Space, isn't there? I think Everspace is the one that's like a top down perspective, isn't it? Still waiting on Arc Raiders. I don't know what Arc Raiders is. I haven't even heard of that one. Space Looter Fighter game. Like freelancer. Uh, Brad, I'm gonna guess that you've played this a lot. Can I eat hazel? Don't cause any problems, does it? Look at all the vitamins and shit it gives you. This game's mega in depth. Let's get my nerd for a while. I can eat hazel. Nice. All right, there we go. We're eating hazel. At least it's summer. It's better than nothing. Stomach's still empty. <laughs> oh, the hazelnut walnut are feeding the way in, though. It's a nut. Isn't there a type of hazel that's poisonous, though? Is that like witch hazel or some shit I'm thinking of? I don't know. I don't know what I'm thinking of. Ooh, there's a drill press in here. 
Industrial gardening hoe. Where my holes at? Drink some water. I would if I had any. <laughs> Gonna have to drink more wine. We're getting merry. Ugh, come on, food. I mean, there's lots of houses around here, but I ain't finding shit. Can I play some b-ball? Window job. No. I'm in Zio. Yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty crap around here. Spent a shit ton of time in this game. I spent a lot of time dying in it. Before I knew how to play it. <laughs> I mean, I'm still no master, but I know how to not die. Ooh, a salt backpack. You know I'm taking that. You know I'm taking that. Can I shift click in this game? You can't, can you? Let's double click. Uh, our creators going to be co-op multiplayer. I don't know, I've never heard of it. I know that town, how in the ever living Christ did you end up down there? I don't know, it's where I got chucked out at plane. <laughs> Only CPV, did you spawn down there? Yep, Corp MP. Yep, I did. I got chucked out of the plane down here. Oh, sh shit. Stay in there, boy. I want none of you, mate. None of you. In fact, come to the window and I'll cheese you. Come to the window and I'll cheese you. Go on, boy. I'm so glad they can't climb through windows. Yet. Because he's a pretty big boy. Yeah, I know. They're going to add that. They're breaking down doors and stuff. It's going to be a nightmare. But hopefully by the time that happens, you should be nice equipped. Nicely equipped to deal with it. Uh, you got a lot of crap on you. I don't, I don't care about any of it. I don't care about any of it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, painkillers. I will take them. I don't want the goggles, though. Yeah, rags. Scum War Thunder, ready or not, far more snow and a demonologist and a few others. Uh, there's a lot of games. <laughs> but I know that feeling. <laughs> so many games, not enough time. Elite as well, yep. I've still got Elite on back burner. Elite's one of them, like, guilty pleasure games. You play it when you got time, right? Yep, never enough free time. Right, I'm all turned around now, I don't know. I came down here, didn't I, so... Got to run. No worries, Brad. Thanks for stopping in. Enjoy the rest of work, as impossible as it sounds. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Uh, we've got far too many games going, not enough time to play them all. Yep. You're right there. Vending machine. Ooh, a cup of coffee. Hey, I'm drinking that. I am drinking that. Ooh, sunglasses. Yeah. Why the hell not? Uh, ED is when you're feeling like you want to get beat up to shit by pixels. <laughs> pixels? All oh, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, I get you. <laughs> I get you. Yeah. The dog fighting in that game is just... When you haven't got a shit hot ship, it's just... Nah. It's very hard. It's harder than scum. I mean, you see me just pull the shit you out of a few son zombies. Of a bitch. And it were uh, not too so bad. 
Yo, Devra Pali, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated and welcome to the team. How are you doing? Yeah, it is merciless. I hope I didn't butcher your name, by the way, Devra Pali. Because if I did, I just did it again. <laughs> uh, so I stick to trading ED. Yeah, it gets boring just doing that all the time, though. It's pretty boring. It's like when you're just flying from place to place, it gets boring pretty quick. Especially if you've got the frigging uh, super cruise assist and landing assist and all that shit on. It's like you're not even doing no. Might as well not play it game. <laughs> so I don't like Microsoft Flight Simulator. Good game, but what's the point playing it? Once you've like, took off. The game pretty much does everything for you. Put this, put it on autopilot. What's the point? Uh, I'm no good at combat. Oh, I'm all right at combat, but I still find it hard. It's like it's, it's pretty cheaty. Get annihilated in seconds on that game. But I suppose that's why you do a shit ton of trading. Upgrade your ship, get it bigger and better, and then you go out trying to fight people. Uh, nope. You can stay in there, mate. You are not wanted. Uh, how many players on server is this PV? It's single player. I don't do PvP at all. Can't stand PvP. But, depending how it goes and how Daz feels, we might end up doing a multiplayer on this, I don't know. We do have a lot of games to be getting on with, but, you know. We've dropped, um, what is it, Stranded Deep, because the game just cannot seem to work properly, so we drop that. Ooh. A garage. I'm hearing a lot of zombies. Or puppets, if you like. Ooh, a fishing reel. Set that for later. Never ending cycle of MP games yet. That's right. We've got loads we haven't even started on yet. Uh, I'm gonna take a screwdriver. They sound awfully close. I do not like the sound of it. Stranded Deep's just broken, yep. And we had a look at updates, didn't we? And it doesn't seem like they've done all about it or gonna do all about it. So, yeah, it's a bit of a problem. That's say it wouldn't be so bad if, like, when you got desynced and kicked out, it didn't take 15 minutes to load. But sitting there doing that all the time, nah, no thanks. Um, Looks like a good version of Seven Days to Die. Oh, this game. This game's awesome. It's way better than Seven Days to Die. A lot more in depth as well. Oh, I've found a pistol holster. Nice, nice, nice. Should we put a Halloween mask on? I mean, it's clipping through me up, but, you know, it's, it's a bit of armour, right? Where did sunglasses go? Are they underneath it? Yeah, they are. <laughs> cool. Got one more if you're interested. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm going to need God to add more hours to today. <laughs> What's that one, Jimmy? Shall I put a bra on? What do you think, guys? Nah. I ain't got no titties. Railroads online. Uh, Railroads online. I I asked you if you wanted to play that a long time ago, Jimmy, and you said you didn't like it. What changed? Have they updated it and made it better? So it's piqued your interest? What changed? Uh, can I put my axe somewhere else? Because I'm going to need this fishing rod, to be fair. Uh, let's move the reel down there. Oops, screwdriver down there. I don't really need high patch, do I? Get rid of that. Move that down there. Put my axe over here. And stick fishing rod on my back. Uh, yep, that. i just got a free key. <laughs> Alright. 
<laughs> that explains it better. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a decent game. I've played it. Uh, it's a bit finicky to do building and stuff, but it's it's a good game. It's like if you can get into it and do all building and stuff, it is it is pretty satisfying game. No, I don't have it. I uh, played the demo, I think. Back when it had one. Hmm. Yeah, the water at one point. I think it got. Uh, I think it got took down though. You know, because they were going to early access. So I just remember it saying Rail "Railroads Online Demo Play." That's all I remember from it. But yeah, it's, uh, I think they I think they took it down for reasons I can't remember. I think it would cost them moved up to a different version at game or something. Yeah, no demo. Oh, it's 30 quid as well. Wow. I definitely want 30 quid when I were looking at it. <laughs> it was like 15, I think, half at price. Uh, let me. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I want to check the taste of it. Ah, that's why. Yes. That's why the demo got took down. Because Astragon bought it, didn't they? Yeah, Astragon bought it. That's why the demo got took down. Uh, what happened to that apple? Is it in the cooker? Wait, what? No, it's in here. Alright, let me check it. I can't check the taste. And I can't eat it. Wait a minute, what's going on here? Why can I not eat an apple? What? Looks good though. Yeah, it's. Uh, I mean, they're updating it all the time and it's got massive potential. And it is quite good. Uh, I'm confused here, guys. Anybody know why I can't eat an apple? Oh, wait a minute. Have they made it like Star Citizen? They've made it like Star Citizen, haven't they? Guaranteed. Got to take the mask off. Yep. They've made it like Star Citizen. You didn't usually have to do that. You didn't never used to have to take the mask off. But yeah, they seem to have made it like Star Citizen. You gotta take your friggin' mask off. Early access multiplayer online co-op. Yep, it's a good multiplayer game. Because it's like you can you can build your own tracks and stuff like that. It's pretty cool to be honest. It is pretty cool. Did we check upstairs here? Can't remember, I got excited about that apple. <laughs> First bit of food I've friggin' seen. Don't want no zombies. A harmonica. I don't want that. Arena Renovator just released. Nice. I think Arena Renovator, I don't think it looks as good as Hotel Renovator. I do like I do like Hotel Renovator. But it still looks a decent game. It's not quite as good as the hotel one. Uh nope. See you later. Not dealing with anybody right now. I just want to get some friggin' food. Yeah, I hear you up in window. Sure up. You can't get me, so do one. Uh, Hotel Renovator has awesome storyline. Yeah, I've seen a bit of it. Well, I've seen you play it, and then I've seen some other people play it as well. Does seem to have quite a lot going. Uh, I don't know how to really use this yet, so I'm not going to mess with that, and I don't really need to, I don't think. Mobile phone? No. We don't need you. 
Uh, at least my food and drink stabilizing a little bit. Right. Did I already? No, I didn't search it. Did I? Ah, come on. Not gonna give me anything. No. I like having choices in this game as well. You don't want to play in first person, you go to third. You don't want to play in third, you go to first. I like the choices. Well, I've got a holster. Can I find a gun at some point, please? I mean, I've got some 9 mils. I haven't found a mag, so I'll have to chamber around, but... Never mind. It's fine. Chambering around does work. So, it is fine. I bet there's one in here, isn't there? Nope. No Zombros. Uh, yeah. Nothing. Nothing I want. Padlock. Don't need that right now. Anybody home? No. Brains. Search that then. Still need some food. In this case, an apple a day is not going to keep the doctor away. I need some frigging proper food. There's an up upstairs. Oh. Nothing. Maybe a zombie? No. Keep calling them zombies, they're puppets. Well, there ain't shit in here, is there? There's a bra. Anybody need a bra? Oh, nice. Caramel soda. That is a good find. That is a good find. Uh, I just need to have space for it. Brazzers. <laughs> Another tracksuit top. Oh yeah, that's the glue. That's the glue! Right, we are going to drink. Oh, let's check it. Yeah, it's fine. Right, we're going to drink all of this caramel soda when I remember to take my mask off. We're going to drink all of that because we need it. We desperately need it. It gives you a bit of food as well. It's caramel soda. It is a damn good find. Ooh, I don't know, looking at that actually, we might have to stop drinking it so we don't get over full and save a bit for later. Yeah, maybe go back 50%. Yeah. Yeah, we've got 55% in stomach. The colon's all backed up. <laughs> the walnut is, and the coffee and soft drink are still getting in the system as well. Alright, but we're going to keep that. That's a damn good find. That's, that's saved my life, is that? It's saved my life. As you'll see, see, not empty stomach anymore. The caramel soda. I think, guess because it's caramel, it gives you a bit of food as well. It gives you energy, carbs, water. Really good find. That's saved my life. So see, it's, it's not like this game's on impossible, guys. It's just... Tough to begin with. Speaking of which, I need to hydrate myself. So I'm gonna close this door and have a drink. See, a lot of people get put off put off of this game because they look at like all the metabolism system and stuff like that and think oh my god that is a very very hard game too much to get your head round like it's not honestly it's not it's like with the metabolism thing right 
All you have to do, really, is if you're hungry, eat. If you're thirsty, drink. And you just keep an eye on these things, you know. So it goes into your stomach, then to your intestine, then to your colon. When your colon fills up, take a dump. Same with your bladder. That fills up, take a piss. Uh, I mean, you do have to, like, watch these carbs and stuff. I mean, you're not really, though. You can get vitamin deficiencies, but it doesn't really affect you too much. So you don't have to keep an eye on them too much. You've got your muscle and fat that you don't even really need to keep an eye on. You've got your vitamins that you don't need to keep an eye on too much. You just make sure you're fed and watered and you're good. You know what I mean? you got your BCU monitor all over here with all your body stuff. you got your stats for your character. Most of the time, I ignore half this stuff. I just look at health, see what's going on down here. And see what's going on going over here, that's it. Graphics could use an overall too, look very similar to the seven days to die. Mm, nah, these are better, I'd say, but I mean, the game has been in development a long time. And I don't have everything maxed out, like for the sake of the frame rate and the uh, the stream. Now, see, I, don't, I think they're changing this. This showed all your muscles and veins and stuff before, and you could, like, you know tick these to uh, see which one you wanted to look at but I think they've changed it a bit runs better than 7 days to die, 100% yeah, definitely very definitely did I search here? is this a different no, it's the same place isn't it yeah, just, just carries on Yeah, graphics aren't bad. I mean, it's the it's the textures, I think, that are, you know, they're not as high res as they could be, but if you take in consideration the size of this damn map, <laughs> it took me, what, 15, 20 minutes to run from there to there. So if you consider the size of the map, I don't think they're doing a bad job with graphics. It's absolutely huge. Yep, it's first person as well. You can play the entire game any way you want. First or third. It's entirely up to you. I stay in third most of the time so I can see around me. But then I'll go into first if, like, you know, it's a tight, confined area or something. I have found a pharmacy. This might be some good stuff in here. If anybody does want to get this game, you can find it for £10 at the moment on CD keys. Damn good price for this game. Not sponsored, but you know. I like to save people money. Uh, potassium iodide pills. They will come in handy. 100%. Uh, safety pins do come in handy to make lock picks, but uh, not right now. I've got other things to focus on, like finding better food. I mean, the caramel drink's good. I need a proper meal. Sort me out. I mean, he's nope. I mean, he's pretty sorted out right now. If you look, the nothing's in the red anymore. We are doing pretty good as far as metabolism goes. Nothing down here. He's got boosts of energy from caramel soda, which is good. Uh, do I take on this guy then? Uh, I mean... Ugh. Oh, uh, looks like I'm going to have no choice. God damn it. Get away, you prick. Get away, you fat prick. Yeah, I just saw him run out of the back door like, oh shit. It's about to get real. Pokey pokey. See, these bigger guys are harder to kill. S killed my stamina then. He's another prisoner. Guess he didn't make it. And he ain't gonna make it because he's finished now. 
All right, note to self. Also check back door. Because <laughs> I could have just locked him in, but I can get the uh, loot now. Yep, RE4 remake. It's getting uh, raving reviews as well. I mean, it always was a good game, so... Surprised that it's got good reviews. Pen, no. I don't want no pen. I would like some meds. That would be a good thing. There's all sorts of stuff you can find and craft in this game as well. There's loads of stuff in this game. And it's got cars. Bicycles, motorbikes, aeroplanes, boats, real good selection of vehicles. I mean, I'd like to find a bicycle, but uh, not come across one yet. Might start looking for somewhere to call home soon. Because it's going to get dark. Uh, don't have a watch, do I? No, can't tell what time it is. And when it gets dark, I do not want to be out here. Not that the zombies get any worse at night. You just can't see shit. And you end up dead pretty quick. Fireworks. Nothing to light them with. That now thick. No worries, Jimmy. Ah, that is probably for fishing line, right? Take that. I ain't got everything I need for a fishing rod yet, though. I need. I need bait and I need a hook. Ah, oh, damn it, you can make a hook out of a safety pin. Ah, oh, damn it, now I need another safety pin. I need to find another safety pin. Oh, no, no, no. Sorry, lady, I'm not interested in your shit. Get out of here. Right, I'm going to go back up there and get that safety pin. She's making some noise. She's making a good old racket. Uh, where was it? Did I pull it out of the inventory? Uh, I don't know. Anybody remember what uh, it was in one of these boxes, wasn't it? Or it? No. Oh. Anybody remember where it's safety pin was? Ah, uh, the screwdriver would appear on it. Where's the safety pin? Must have been downstairs. Or in the other room? Yes, it was. Right. Let's see what we can do while we're here. Um, right, where is the fishing stuff? I have never done this, so I don't know how to do it. Can make a lock pick. Um, ha, ah, can make a suppressor out of a bottle. I have never done this. Ooh, metal detector. Improvised grenade launcher, nice. Bundle of rags. How do I do this? Put it under food? No. Hmm. Geiger counter. Holy shit. Improvised bulletproof armor. How'd you make that? Leather, metal scrap, a saw, thread. A birthday hat. Eh. Improvised fish hook, there we go. Oh, I need a can. It's not with the safety pins, it's a ring pull off of a can. 
That's what I need. I'll tell you what I will do. That as well. Make a lock pick. I think I've got a screwdriver. Yes, I do. Uh, one lock pick went up the floor. I'm going to start needing to clean some crap out of my backpack soon, to be honest. Stuff that's not imperative. If I could give any advice in this game, don't sprint everywhere. Just jog. Because then you'll run into zombies and you'll have no stamina to fight them. And it'll end badly. Uh, no. Should really clear place before I start looking for loot, but I don't think there's anybody down on this floor, to be honest. Rope always in hand, comes in handy. Baseball cap? Meh. Nah. Halloween mask. I do like that one better. Because it can just go on under that hat as well. <laughs> I mean, the other one's more of a helmet though, isn't it? Do they offer. Do they even offer any protection? I think they do. Jane Doe Halloween mask. Greek Halloween mask. Hey, Jimmy! <laughs> There's a Greek Halloween mask. Didn't even know it were a Greek Halloween mask. Devs! That looks nothing like Jimmy. Stop it. <laughs> How do I put this frigging fishing rod together? That's what I'm trying to figure out here. I don't actually know how to do it. Can I, like, just do it on the floor or something? Decontaminate. Take in hands. Pick up. Can I add the reel just to it somehow? Do I have to screw it on? I don't, I don't know how to do this. Never watched anybody get the fishing rod, so I don't really, really know what I'm doing with it, to be honest. How do you get upstairs? I think I did hear a zombie up here, though, so... It's probably going to be me just leaving here. No? No puppet up here? Okay, cool. What is that? A tracksuit top. Well, it's a better colour than mine. A bit more inconspicuous, so we'll put that on. Take our reel back. What is that? Double bang firecracker. Eh, I can't light the bloody things, that's the problem. Not only that, I don't exactly want to draw puppets in air with him either. seen any animals yet. Usually go hunting and stuff. Assault backpack? Is that better than military backpack? Don't know, right. That's like what? Two, four, six, eight. No wait, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen lines. This is two. Oh god, one, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. It's the same. It is the same. Although I do like the colour of it better. So I'm probably going to take it. 
see there's another cool feature on this game as well. See how backpacks all kind of like deflated. You'll see as I fill it up with my stuff. It'll pad out. Little cool, uh, little cool thing. There you go, there's stuff in it now. And the one on the floor is deflated. Uh, I didn't lose my bank card, did I? No. Uh, another backpack. No, I don't want to equip it, you dick. Let's see if there's all in it. No, nothing in it. I don't think there's ever all in them when you find them. Hello! Good morning, world! Hello, zombies! I'd like to run away. <laughs> I wonder if there's a boat anywhere down here. Then again, I didn't get that paddle, did I? Yeah, a bit pointless. You know, sometimes in a zombie apocalypse, it's good to just take a seat. <laughs> take a seat and have a rest. Get your stamina up. See, my drink's full now. My food's getting there. That's thanks to the caramel soda. It's awesome, that stuff. Love it. Although there's no in my stomach and my intestine at the moment, but the coffee and the drink are uh, still going in. Still doing their thing. Bladder's 42%. I suppose we'd better take a leak, haven't we? Ah, uh, just got my boots wet like an idiot. Mm. Don't worry, guys. Nudity sensor's on. I don't need to piss yet. I don't need to vomit. Ah, uh, I've wet my frigging boots. Uh Right then. Campfire it is. Uh, bonfire, no. Fire ring, improvised fireplace. What does that take? Uh, I don't want to use rat my rags. Oh. Not not to light it with other. What about a uh, bow drill? How the frig is it? No, you can make a hand drill. I do know you can uh, be crafting. Hand drill, hand drill, hand drill. Improvised fishing line. That I can do, but I don't know how to put the fishing rod together, so that's pointless at the moment. Uh, hand drill, where's the hand drill? Should really... Dildo crossbow bolt? Dildo spear? No. <laughs> I don't think we need them. I should really look at getting a bow going though. Yeah, that'd be a good idea to be honest. But there is a fire drill. Two long sticks. I don't think I'm going to get long sticks from this, but there you go. I got one long stick. Can't you make it with... Yeah, I can make it anyway. Do that. Let's make a fire drill. Oh, you still there, Daz? Who is still there? Where's everybody gone? Where has everybody gone? Oh, Daz is still there. So what are you thinking so far, Daz? See, it's not as not as hard as it looks, is it? Not as hard as it looks. Just sat watching here. You know, I might get rid of this fishing rod, you know, because I don't even know how to put it together. 
Let's store it somewhere. Yeah, I'll probably store it somewhere. So I think what I'm going to do is... Will that stick fit in there? No. Will it fit in anywhere? I mean, it can't fit in my pocket. That's I should have known that, but... Uh, let's see what it takes to make a bow. Probably be a good friggin' idea, wouldn't it? With a £35 draw, uh, draw weight, no. I ain't got the skill for that. Or have I? Start with a £20 draw weight. Uh, £35 draw weight's not much, you know. Yeah, let's do it. Ah, crap, I'm gonna need feathers, aren't I? I ain't got no feathers. Yeah. Gonna need feathers. Wooden arrow. Oh, wooden, normal wooden arrows don't take feathers, they just take sticks. They're not very good, but at least it's doable. Thing is, <laughs> I have to drop this fishing rod. You know what, I'll come back for it. Screw it, I'll come back for it and get my bow. In fact, just put it in my hand. Just put it in my hand and what I think I'll do is make this house a temporary home. You can shut up, you zombie prick. Store some stuff in this cupboard. Wait, can I? Oh, you can't store stuff in here, can you? Of course. Of course you can't. Damn it. Oh, there's a zombie in here. Holy shit, where did you come from? I've searched in there. Where did that fool come from? Fair enough, I'll make me temporary house upstairs then. Screw you. Right, tell you what. Let's just drop the damn thing. Drop the reel. What else have I not? Where's that zombie now? It didn't get out, did it? It cause me problems if it did. Nah, it didn't get out. Can you come up the window? Yeah, you're at the door. Can you come to the window? Come to the window. Come on. Over here. Over here. Over here. Listen to the sound. Over here. You're not coming out the door, so I don't care. Over here, dummy. Oh well, I as well take advantage of him being stuck on the table. He probably won't be there for long, like. But... Might as well take advantage of him. Shut him up. Wow. This is kicking the shit out of my stamina. It does come back pretty fast though, which is good. Let's see what he's got on him. Yeah, nothing useful. He's got some nice trainers, but they're wrecked. So yeah, I'm gonna leave him there. Right, can I get on what we're doing? Thank you. Alright, let's get some sticks. Let's cut this down. And I am going to have to go get something to eat in a minute, guys. So I'm going to end the stream pretty soon. Uh, why have you still got the saw in your hands? Back in the backpack, please. Uh, I'm gonna cut that into small sticks. You must have known, right? That's why he had it in his hand. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. It definitely does. 
I'm starving. Absolutely starving. And then, of course, we're back at 8 o'clock with some... Uh, no one survived. Oh, maybe seven. We'll see. I mean, it's scheduled for eight, but we'll uh, we'll see. All right, crafting wooden arrows. Uh, can I make multiple at a time? No, I can't. Not on that. Because I ain't got a workbench, have I? So, yeah. They are pretty quick, though. Oh, I just thought... I haven't got a quiver. That's going to be a problem. I'm making quite a few here. Wait, is he even making them? Oh, yeah, yeah, he's making them. He is making them. Two more sticks left. Right, uh, there's an improvised quiver somewhere. Hmm, where is it? That's the question. Where is the improvised quiver? How do you make an improvised flashlight? Uh, with a flashlight and tape. <laughs> right, makes sense. Improvised crossbow. Oh, nice. Now, how the frig do you make an improvised quiver? Fishing reel. I've got a proper one of them. I don't need that. I can't even see the improvised quiver. That's advanced. Can't make any of that shit. Uh, stick bundle. Practice bomb. Oh, that's to, yeah, practice diffusal skills. Empty bag, tinder torch, improvised stab proof vest, small improvised backpack, head sack, improvised quiver. I do want to make a tooth necklace or any a necklace at some point. Alright, uh, improvised quiver is three cloth, rope, and five long sticks. Damn it. <laughs> we just use the long sticks. All right, cut another bush down then. And I'm probably gonna have to cut one of my jackets up, but you know, never mind. It's in the pursuit of better stuff. And he's sweating anyway, so I'm probably, to be honest, just gonna cut the tracksuit top up. Or maybe it raincoat, I don't know. And the raincoat does keep you dry, but eh. Too easy for the zombies to see though. Uh, right, five long wooden sticks. I've got one, two, three. So still need to cut some more foliage. Closer. Two. Three. Four. And five long wooden sticks. Right. Improvised quiver. We need three rags. Yes. That I can do by cutting up the raincoat. <coughs> I mean, we have two rags, and I don't really need boxer shorts on. Uh, oh, okay, again. I want to say, what are you doing? There's just a lot of them. Right, craft an improvised quiver. Bada bing, bada boom. I don't know why it takes long wooden sticks to do a quiver. I'm supposing the... Uh, the rigid, yeah, the rigid part of it. Alright, okay, cool. And we're gonna take 
couple of these. No, actually, I am not. I am going to make a bundle of rags because it's easier to carry. How many does it hold? Five, I think. Yeah, put all of them in there. It is a little bit larger, but if I could remember how to rotate frigging things. Aha! Control and scroll wheel. There we go. Oh, not in the quiver, you dick. There, we've got us bundle of rags, so anytime we need a... a what is it? A frigging uh, bandage. We'll pull them out of there, right. Arrows. Need to go in there. Two, three, four. You can only have 12 in here. We've got 9 out of 12. So what we'll do is... We'll craft some more. You can have more in a proper quiver, but... You can only have 12 in here. 9, that's 10. 11 and 12. And we will take them into the quiver. Coolio! Anything else on the floor we want? Uh, probably going to need some sticks and stuff because I want to make a fire. So, craft. See, I'm addicted to this game now. I'm supposed to be going to get my food, but, you know. <laughs> addicted to the damn game. Uh, bundle of sticks. I know you can make a bundle of sticks. Where is it? Bundle of small sticks. Should have done that earlier. I don't know why I didn't think of that when I was trying to put that frigging shelter up. Don't know why I didn't think of that. And a wood bundle. Now let's see how big these are. Ooh, too big for me to put in my pocket. How big actually are they? Not gonna show me, are you? Alright, I'll put the potassium iodide in there. I don't like to drop rope, but I might have to. What happened there? This can put the rope in my pocket. Okay, nah, yeah. It has a. Yeah. As a capacity. 1.5 kg, so I can't put the other rope in. I'll put the bullets in my pocket. The tape. And the line. Cool. Let's move some stuff over. I'll rotate that. In fact, I'm going to eat that soon. Although it is just a bundle of spices, you can't eat that shit. I can't put... Uh... Right, fine, 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 fine. Alright, let's see how big these are. Oh, actually, yeah. That's going to take a lot of shuffling around. Uh... In fact, it's going to take shuffling around that I can't do... Maybe? No. Still not going to work. Aha! Yes! Right. Where's the house I'm using? It's up here and it upstairs. I don't really want to know using upstairs one because if they come at the door trapped in there because I can't jump out. If I use this one I can just jump out the window. Right and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put down a fire. That's gonna take stones in it. Yeah and logs. This one just takes sticks. So I'm gonna put that one down. Oh, wait, what the hell does that require? Gunpowder or something? Or paper or... Wait, what else can we use? Rags. Hmm, fine, I guess. 
Fine, we can use rags. Uh, right, inventory. I need to pull them sticks out and unpack them. It only holds two in that thing. Seriously, game? Oh, well, we got more sticks over here. And we got rag strips as well, so yeah. Oh, wait, we got more arrows. Did I not pick them up? Obviously didn't, did I? Right, we'll put the rag strips in first then. I'd rather use rag strips than rags, because rags are better for bandages. Yeah, I know I'm hearing you, but I'm not seeing you. I think that's that same zombie that's in that building, so... Oh, it only takes one. Alright, cool. You can just fuel it with more then if you need to. Right, it needs three sticks. Three sticks. There's a bush right here, so why not? Why not? Need it our way anyway, so... You can see out the damn place. One. Mm. Take one in your hand then. Put them in, and then it only needs one more, which I don't have. There's a long one. I'll cut it into small sticks. Bada bing, bada boom, we have a fire. I can dry my boots off. I should not have walked in that friggin' water. It was not a smart idea. Although they might have just dried off the self by now, to be honest. Have a look. Yeah, they're dry. They've dried off. Well, whatever. Got a fireplace when I need it. I can't remember how you save the game. Ah, it's, it's, it's a server in it, so yeah, it just it, it saves when you leave the game. Yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha. Alright, since before I go and get my food, since we've got a few spare arrows out there, I'm going to test this bow, see what he's like at pulling it. It is a £35 draw weight, but I don't think it should be too bad. See if we can get it through that window. Oh, <laughs> shot and a half. Shot and a half. Did I kill it? I killed it. Holy shit, what a shot. What a shot. That were awesome. I think we can get the arrows back as well, but I'm just going to take one from the ground because it's a new one. What a shot that was, guys. That were absolutely awesome. So he's okay with £35 draw weight, clearly. You give me my arrow back? Yes, you do get your arrows back. I don't think you get them back all the time, because like, they can break, but yeah. There's some paper for fire as well. Oh, I don't need it now, do I? Idiot. But yeah, that was... Ooh, it's a woman. <laughs> But yeah, what a shot. Honestly. That was pretty awesome. So, we're doing alright for surviving. We've got a good couple of weapons going. Just one-shotted a puppet with a crafted bow and arrow, which is cool. Can I move you out of my friggin'... No, I can't. Chop him up and move his bits out, I guess. Do you know what, guys? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Let's <laughs> chop him up. <laughs> you can even cut the teeth out of the head and stuff like that. Cut ears and teeth out. It's a very in-depth game. And then I can make an ear necklace. Yeah. Might scare the zombies off. Right, where is my ear necklace? 
I ain't gonna wear that. It's underneath the top. Oh no, it is. It's outside the top. <laughs> I'm wearing an ear necklace, guys. I think you can wear the skin as a mask as well. I am pretty sure you can wear their skin as a mask. Although I ain't got his skin hand fan. The hell? Bet you can make some funky weapon out of that. But yeah, just dump all his body parts outside because I, I don't want as his guts. Yeah, it's going to be hard to dump them all outside door, but and they're probably getting away anyway. So I don't know. I'll leave them there. They'll probably despawn when I come back in. So. Hell with it. Leave them there. These crappy claws as well. Right, but that's going to end this stream, guys. Back later on tonight with some more No One Survived. Thanks to everyone that joined, jumped in chat and followed. And I'll see you all soon.